हेयर वी गो वी हैव ए क्वेश्चन डिलीशन एंड रिवर्स इन ए सर्कुलर लिंक लिस्ट सो यू हैव गिवन ए सर्कुलर लिंक लिस्ट एंड द टास्क इज कंप्लीट द गिवन नोड हुज वैल्यू इज इक्वल टू द की इन ए सर्कुलर लिंक लिस्ट एंड आल्सो नीड टू परफॉर्म द रिवर्सल ऑपरेशन द नोट हियर इज यू डोंट हैव टू प्रिंट एनीथिंग वी जस्ट नीड टू रिटर्न द हेड ऑफ द मॉडिफाइड लिस्ट सो हियर वी हैव ए टेस्ट केस सो वी हैव दिस लिंक लिस्ट so we have a target value key value is equal to 8 so after deleting this node we have a circular link list except this particular node and the next thing is to reverse a uh, circular link list so this is the resultant but the output image is not correct so here it represent a singular link list but the expected output is the reversal is the circular link list so that's about the description so let's try to build the approach so i have taken this test case so on the first iteration first we need to delete a node so let's take a key value is equal to 3 so to delete a node we need to access its previous node so first current value point to this value so we need to check is current next is equal to the target node no it is not so jump to the next node is current next is equal to the target node in this case yes so we need to delete this node or in other words we need to disconnect the connection so we just need to change this connection and two's next will be its next to next so now we have a link list this so third node is just ignored so that's how this uh, uh, deletion will work so after making this deletion we need to reverse this link list also so first we need to access the last node to make it a circular to make it a singular link list so first we have a, a circular link list so to make it a singular link list we need to access the last node so current now point to this value is current next is equal to the head node no so jump to the next value jump to the next node is current next is equal to head no jump to the next node is current next is equal to head yes so we need to just disconnect this connection so just erase the connection and after erasing this connection we have a singular link list so i hope you are familiar with the reversal process of a singular link list so if you are not a video link is available in the i button so be sure to check out that video first then come over to this video so to make it a reversal to make it uh, to make reversal of a singular link list we have a resultant this so before that we need to first save this node we need to first save this node so let's give it a name so i am calling a original head so this is the original head and this is the new head this is the new head so our initial uh, circular link list will look like this now original head original head value is 1 original head value is 1 so this is our original head so its next point to null we need to make it a circular so its next will now point to the head node now point to the head node so we just need to return the head value head node so now we have as you can clearly see we have a reversal of the given circular link list so that's about this but we have some edge cases also so let's take this example 1 2 3 4 then this our key value is equal to 1 key value is equal to 1 and this is our head node we need to check is current next is equal to target no jump to the next node is current next is equal to target no jump to the next node is current next is equal to target no jump to the next node is current next is equal to the target yes in this case yes so what we need to do is we need to change the connection so this connection will now point to this so as you can see we have removed our head itself so head value is equal to 
the target value so now our new head will be this so if head dot value head dot data is equal to k means our head node itself gets removed so we need to return head dot next only so after we return this this is the edge case we have another edge case also one two three four then this our k is five and headed head is this so we need to check we need to first check is our k value present in a list or not so to check to check this in a circular link list it is very simple but in a circular link list it's a bit tricky so our current node points to this node we need to check is its value is equal to the target value no so jump to the next node is the value equal to the target value no so jump to the next node is it value equal to the target value no so jump to the next node now current is equal to head so get rid of the while loop we check all the values starting from the second node we have not checked our first node so we need to also check is current value equal to the target value in this case no so if our value is not found we just need to return the head node so we have also handled this edge case but we have another edge case also so let's take this example so what if there are multiple nodes whose value is equal to the target node so in that particular case we need to remove the first occurrence so this is our head node our current points to this value our current points to this value so let's take one another example side by side this is our head node and this is our current node so current node will point to the target node itself so we need to check is the current value is equal to k in this case yes so we will just stop here so for this case we need to delete 2 so our k value is equal to 2 so for that case for this case we need to check is the current value is equal to k no so we need to jump to the next node is the value equal to k yes so now our current points to this value so now in this case current points to this value in this case current points to this value because we want to delete one for this link list but to delete the current node we need access of its previous node so this is our third iteration in our first iteration we just check if the value is there or not in our second iteration we initialize the current node to the target node that we want to delete the first occurrence if there are multiple occurrences in our third iteration we will point the previous node to the head node and we need to check is previous next is equal to target is previous next equal to the current node yes so we will stop previous there so in this case previous will stay here so for this case previous now points to this head node is previous next point to current node no so move your previous is previous next point to the current node no is previous next point to current node no is previous next point to current node no is previous next point to current node previous next points to current node yes so we need to delete this connection and we need to connect its next to next node and for this case we need to delete this connection and its connection will be this so the code 
will look like this previous dot next will now point to previous dot next to its next so that's how it will work so that's about the approach let's code this so first we have delete node in our first iteration we need to check if the value is present or not so we start from the second node and we have a uh, variable found so current will not equal to our first node if key is there we change our boolean then we go to the next node so we have not checked the first node itself so that's the code to do that if the value is not there just remove the head node on our second iteration we need to point the current node to the target node that we want to delete while current dot data is not equal to key move forward so in the third iteration we need to delete the current node so to delete that node we need to access its previous node so temporary will first point to the head node while temporary dot next not equal to head node temporary will move forward and this is the code to disconnect the link to delete the current node to delete this node so after making a deletion we need to check is our head itself gets deleted if our head itself get deleted we need to return the second node if the head stays same we just need to return the head itself so that's about the head node uh, function so let's try to reverse the link list reverse the circular link list so we first need to make a, a singular link list so current will point to the last node so current dot next node equal to head current will move forward now first we need to disconnect the link we have a singular link list now and first store the original head and re and reverse the singular the reverse the singular link list so this is the function uh, i have made a separate function for this this is the reverse it so it will give me the head of a reverse link list so we have a new head again we need to establish a connection to make a circular link list so the last node the next pointer will point to the head node itself and we need to return the head node so let's give it a try and let's talk about time at space complexity in this function we have a while loop and a separate function so it will work for order of n and it will work for order of n so the time complexity is order of n for this particular function for this function we have three while loops so it will also uh, work for order of n and space complexity is constant so we have met the expected time and space complexity if you guys have any doubt feel free to ask in the comment section uh, the code is given in the description box so if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel and thank you all for watching